of the day. I know. I'm sitting there trying to pronounce it, and I just couldn't. Yeah. 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 Wow. Inspiration. What is inspiration? I do a lot of research for every time I do a speech. And so I went to ask.com, and it said, it means a person, an object, or a situation which quickens or stimulates an influence upon the intellect, emotions, or creativity. Hmm. Where do you find inspiration? People? Books? TV? Myself? I usually find it through people. And in, again, my research, I found a couple quotes I want to share with you. To quote Jack London, you can't wait for inspiration. You have to go out and get it with the club. <laughs> the second quote, a little bit more quieter, from Jane Goodall. What you do makes a difference. And you have to decide what kind of difference you want to make. Again, people inspire me. They inspire me every day. I'm a people watcher. I go places and I sit and I watch people. Best place is the racetrack. You watch all the emotions back and forth. And I always look for the best in everybody. The best in every people. Every person. What they do. How can I improve myself? And if I improve myself, how can I inspire others? So today I have three stories of inspiration that inspire me and their people. And uh, let's get going. My first inspiration is my mother. My mother was a very strong person. She was a single mother of five. She worked over 40 hours per week in a hospital cafeteria, making sure that we were fed and clothed. Not only that, she took care of us, she doted on her grandchildren. She also took care of her dying mother. Sadly, my mother passed away at 58 from cancer. Much too young. But with her death, she gave me a new type of inspiration. An inspiration to go have annual checkups. Believe what doctors say. <coughs> Always take care of myself. Diet, exercise, and watch out for myself. She also inspired me to be a good single mother. Not to make the same mistakes that she did. Today I wish she was here to see how much she inspired me. My second inspiration is my daughter Hope. At age 25, she has done so much more than I have ever done in my 50 years. She has a huge heart. Huge. When she was younger, she was a champion for the small and the weak. She brought home animals every day. Mom, can we keep this one? You know, all types of animals. We're talking toads and fish and turtles and crayfish. You name it, she brought it home. When she went into high school, her heart blossomed. She found other items that she can help. She went on missionary trips with our church that we attend. Now, we're just talking in the U.S. Now, these missionary trips ranged from <coughs> teaching vacation Bible school to motel kids in Nevada to rebuilding homes in Hurricane Katrina damaged Mississippi. Then, when she went to college, she joined groups to help fight human trafficking. Yesterday, she came home from a 10-day trip to Myanmar, also known as Burma. She was there helping the other missionaries there to build businesses, because you have to have a business there to stay there. <laughs> Pretty inspirational, right? You know, I can talk about my daughter all day long, and she has so much. But she has inspired me to get out of my comfort zone, 
In the last two years, during the day on Christmas Eve, we would take bagels, blankets, and coffee to the homeless in Fullerton and La Habra. Now at first, I wouldn't have done that. I would. But she has taught me, she has inspired me to get out of myself. Stop being so worried about me and what I have or what I don't have. And now my third inspiration is not just a person. It's a group. It's the Ingram Microphones Toastmasters Group 2592. Mm -hmm. Yes, you have inspired me. <laughs> this group is so amazing to our members. You'll know this. And to our guests, you'll find this out. I tell everybody, people ask me, oh, what, do you, what do you like about Toastmasters? What do you like about Toastmasters? It's the group I belong in. You guys are so amazing. You each inspired me with your confidence, your warmth, and your humor. It's so wonderful to see the support that you give each other, and to me, a non ingram micro employee, but as your Toastmaster family. But by your support, you have helped me keep my goal and desire to help this group to be the best that we can be. You have inspired me. There you have it. My inspirations. By listening to my speech, I hope I have inspired you today. So take a moment today. Go out and watch people. Be inspired. Do you need to go out and get it with a club? Or what kind of difference are you going to make? for today, tomorrow, or in the future. <sighs> One last quote, and for another inspiration of mine, Mary Kay Ash. Aerodynamically, the bumblebee shouldn't be able to fly, but the bumblebee doesn't know it. So it goes on flying anyway. <coughs> so go out and be the bumblebee. Do it anyway. Be an inspiration. Thank you.